gonna stay out there all night? Vincent, I'm impressed. Not that not too many guys our age are uh, still as sharp. Not too many are still around. Do you mind? Still telling me what to do, huh, Vincent? It's not a good idea. You been here long? Long enough. You uh, always leave the shower running? the only guest here this evening, am I? Hope she wasn't too expensive. Yeah, well, that's not your business. Whoa. You spend your money well. Now, I'm not much of a wine drinker myself. I think you got the right idea. Got anything stronger? Vince. Relax. Just a friend dropping by. Come on, have a seat. We can at least have a drink like civilized human beings. Good choice. Except I take mine neat. I thought you knew that. Must have slipped my mind. You're a hard man to find. That was the idea. Vince. I'm retired, Eddie. Retired? The mighty Vincent? <laughs> no. No, 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 no. I call bullshit. <laughs> Just give me a minute. Just give me a minute. This is a little hard to swallow. Retired. <laughs> you know, as much as I appreciate this unannounced visit, it's late. It's your place? A friend's. A friend's? You sure you want out? You know, a couple more contracts, nothing too difficult. Get yourself a nice penthouse overlooking the city. Get you out of this Costa Rican sweat box. You know, I made myself perfectly clear just before my last job, if you remember. Okay. Let's talk about the last job. There's nothing to talk about, Eddie. Now it's late. Late? <laughs> Aren't you the same guy that stayed up for three days with that Gambini queer a couple years back? <laughs> that was 30 years ago. And if you haven't noticed, people change. So, as I was saying... I can take it. But I'm not leaving before we have a toast. All right, a toast to retirement. No, how about to a job well done? To a job well done. 
Except the job wasn't done, Vincent. Why? What are you talking about, Eddie? Answer the question. I don't know what the hell. What? You don't what? Indulge me, Eddie. You fucked up! What the hell is this? Where is it? Between my legs. Where's yours? Where is it? It's in the bedroom. Let's see. Yeah, you had a good <laughs> look. Not as sharp as I thought you were. Unarmed, huh? You know, I don't know what the hell you heard, Eddie. But you know me. I don't fuck up. Vincent, how long we known each other now? Our whole lives, right? You know who I am. You know who I represent. You know what I'm capable of. So seeing that we know each other so well, let me ask you a question, Vincent. Are you calling me an asshole? I don't mean a prick, because I know I'm a prick. I'm asking you specifically if you're calling me an asshole. Because right now, I'm starting to feel like you're treating me like I'm an asshole. So why don't you just answer the goddamn question? I would take this shit from you, you paranoid fuck. Do not insult me again. Vince, you've been on this end before. You know how this works. When there's problems, people want answers. People I report to. Fuck you, Eddie. I know exactly who you report to. And they have a hell of a lot more respect for me than they do you. They pay me big money. Specifically because I don't fuck up. Which is more than I can say for you. So whatever the fuck it is that you think I did, I'm telling you right now, you are totally mistaken. The target's still alive, you arrogant fuck. Or am I mistaken? Hello, Vince. I was hoping it was you. If there were anyone else, you'd be dead already. You really fucked up this time, Andrew. You pissed off the wrong fucking people. You think I give a shit who I piss off? What the fuck happened to you? I don't know, Vince. In the beginning, it was different. If I didn't kill, I didn't breathe. It all made sense back then. Dictator. Revolutionary. Terrorist. We changed the world, Vincent. But this, one of our own, a senator, a woman, or what? An energy bill? What the fuck is that? She had her kids with her, Vince. If it's not me or somebody else, they're not going to stop. What do you want me to do? You do what you came here to do. for your bullshit, Vincent. Come on, Eddie. It's an out-of-focus picture. It doesn't mean dick. You 
know exactly who that was. It was taken two days after you disappeared. They trusted you, Vincent. I trusted you. And you gave it all up for this? I'm gonna tell you right now, you better start talking. Or I swear, I'll kill you right here and right now. Talk. He was one of ours, Eddie. What was I supposed to do? Walk up behind him and put a bullet in his fucking head? Thank him for 30 years of loyal service? The fuck? Even you ain't that fucking mean. Where is he? I don't know. Where is he? I don't fucking know. I walked up behind him, I looked at him, I walked away. He deserved that. We deserved that. Let's get one thing straight, Vincent. I'm here to clean up your mess. I'm not here to see you into retirement. So this is it, huh? 42 years, and this is it, just like that. Just like that. Easy. Easy. You owe me one drink. Still telling me what to do. Let's get one thing straight, Vincent. I don't owe you shit. Come on, Eddie. For old time's sake. Neat, right? Neat. What is it? Nothing. I can see why you moved down here. A different life, a different time. I could see myself living here. Do you ever regret it? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Anything we ever wanted, we had in the palm of our hands. Wanted for nothing. Yeah, except our lives. Oh, boo fucking who. You know, Vincent, if you wanted out, you should have done it a little sooner. It's never too late, Eddie. I'll drink to that. What did you fucking do, Vincent? I can't blame the guy for trying it. <laughs> Fucking kidding me? An ice pick? Uh, uh, <laughs> you fuck. You double crossing ice picking motherfucker. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Oh, I'm in Jesus. Can't you die with no. Andrew, <laughs> you two fucking queers. Are you sure about this? It's the only way I know how. Ah, besides, I've been wanting to retire now for years anyway. You worried about it? Aren't you? Yeah. Only that we won't be able to get a good bottle of wine where we're going. As if you could tell the difference. Hey, I remember when we first met at that wine tasting party downtown. Are you going to bring up that shit again? Your attempt, failed attempt I might add, to impress me with your knowledge of a vintage Pinot Noir was, uh, was embarrassing. 
cute, but embarrassing. So I guess it's uh, too late to try to convince you that I'm actually a, uh, a world-renowned camaleiro. It's pronounced sommelier. You could have just said yes. Side. Uh, you know, we have always had each other anyway. That's all we ever needed. Plus a bottle of that good one. Save just... Ha, 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 ha.